What is up guys, this is Morton Power 35 here. Today what I got for you guys is my very first uh, best class setup video on Infinite Warfare and this is actually going to be my first video on the full game of Infinite Warfare. I did a bunch of videos during the beta, but I wanted to save the best class setup videos for the full game. I know I did some of my favorite assault rifles and stuff like that and attachments and stuff like that, but this is going to be actual best class setups uh, for the game. Now. A uh, disclaimer, I don't actually have a couple of the perks and stuff that I use um, in the, that I'm going to tell you in this setup um, that are going to be in this gameplay. Um, I haven't unlocked them yet, I just tested them out in uh, custom games and I forgot to save the footage. And this is the only footage I had of the guns with the majority of the main attachments and stuff on them. So that's just a forewarning. Um, and then this is actually going to be a two part setup. Um, you're gonna see the first clip is gonna be of one one section of the setup and then the second clip you're gonna see is the, the other uh, version of this setup so without further ado let's go ahead and get into it and as always this is just my opinion and you're more than welcome to uh, tinker with this setup and if you do and you find success comment in the comment section what you um what your uh, class setup would be for this so let's get into it the gun we're gonna be using is the NV4 vigilance which is the rare variant of the NV4 um, and this is going to be my stealth version of this setup. This is where it's going to be just for like playing um, a search and destroy, free for all, and stuff like that, where you don't want to give up your location. Um, and these things will help you to not do that. So the optic will be the Trojan. Um, normally I use the ELO, but for this one, it outlines the enemies even through smoke. Which is kind of like the MMS from Black Ops 2, but I just for some reason I really like this uh, attachment, and um, this will actually be the same on the second one, but I'll get into that later. Uh, the attachments that I'm using is the foregrip, which is standard on all my classes, uh, which reduces uh, recoil. Uh, something new that's in the uh, the class setup this time is extended mag. This gun starts out with 30 bullets per clip, um, and then you have two extra bull two extra clips uh, along with it, um, but the Extended mag gives you 15 more bullets, which means you start out with 45, and then you have um, two more clips of 45 in your uh, your rig. So that helps you go on longer streaks, and you just stay alive longer. Um, and then the suppressor is also new. This just helps you to where you're not um, pinging on the minimap when you're shooting, and then it actually makes your uh, shots silent, uh, or less silent, or more silent, my bad. Um, and the enemies it'll be harder for them to hear you shooting um, or determine what direction you're shooting them from. Uh, and then the lethals that I'm going to use, I'm not using any secondaries, the lethals that I'm going to use on this class is, uh, is just a plasma grenade, um, just rains down pla uh, burning plasma which helps um, even if you die. I know there's a part in this, cl uh, in this clip that I'm using where I throw the plasma grenade but I end up dying by, from the guy but I end up killing him with the plasma grenade which is awesome. I'm not using a tactical. Uh, perk 1 is going to be dexterity which uh, helps you reload faster. It also helps you switch guns faster but for the majority of this it's just going to help you uh, reload faster. Hardline gives you bonus score up to 8 kills per life. Um, just helps you get your score streaks faster. And then um, the one I don't have is uh, the perk 3 which is dead silent which is going to help you move slow. Uh, your movements be quieter and this the way they're doing it this year is it also integrates blast suppressor into dead silence so you're only having to use one perk instead of two um, which helps your uh, when you thruster it quiets that down too and you don't ping on the mini map um, and then the score streaks that you is uses UAV scarab and scorchers just pretty standard stuff um, now the second one that we're going to be using is the sa it's the same gun but I'm going to call this the damage version there's one thing in particular that is different about this class um, and instead of the uh, suppressor we are going to use the um, rifle barrel to give us higher damage at longer ranges so that you're able to shoot uh, people from farther away and uh, be able to just you know get quality kills from farther distances and it also switches um, Dead silence with pinpoint which helps you what pinpoint does is it gives you um, it lets you see enemies names from a farther distance so that you can get longer like mid to longer range where you can get like long shots if you need long shots for a camo or things like that um, 
and then everything else is pretty much the same. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to leave you guys with the rest of this uh, footage, but if you enjoy this video guys, please smash that like button. Um, and comment in the comment section what you think of this setup and if you use it if you find success with it or if you tinker with this setup um, and you just use different uh, different things just comment those in the comment section if you're new to the channel guys please hit that subscribe button um, and as always guys I'll see y'all on the next video